Hello everyone today we are going to learn standard 4th subject EVS topic revision of lesson number 4 water safe for drinking here is one experiment take a glass half full of water and add substances in it one by one and stir it with a spoon from this experiment we see that sh- sugar salt washing soda alum disappeared in the water that is all completely in the water but sand sawdust turmeric powder oil do not disappear even on stirring they do not dissolve some substances dissolve in water while some substances do not solution solution when a substance dissolve in water a mixture of that substance and water is formed this mixture is called the solution of that substance if someone gets loose motion we give them a solution of salt and sugar to drink this solution is called ors or oral rehydration solution a patient in a hospital is sometimes put on a saline that is on solution of salt in water sometimes other medicines may also be given through saline these are the examples of useful solution some salt so sea water is salty to taste water of different wells may have different taste when we remove the lid of a soda water bottle bubbles fizz out of it to make soda water a gas called carbon dioxide is dissolved in water under pressure when the lid is removed the pressure reduces and the gas bubbles out here is a experiment in this experiment we take a large container with water and add the things in it from this experiment we learned that the eraser sharpener steel spoon nail screw stones coin the compass and the soil sink in the water while the pencil plastic ruler rubber band float on the water this means some things float on water while some things sink in it the things that float are lighter than water the things that sink are heavier than water there are three methods of cleaning water first one is a settling take some muddy water in a big beaker now allow this beaker to stand still for 4 or 5 hours from this we come to know that the process of allowing heavier particles to settle to the bottom of still water is called settling second is swirling alum take a piece of alum and swirl it once in the water in the first beaker leave this beaker undisturbed for 2 or 3 hours from this we come to know that swirling alum in water helps the soil particles in muddy water to settle down third is a filtration take another beaker place a tea strainer over it and now pour the water in beaker 2 in a thin stream on the folds of the cloth from this we come to know that if we strain muddy water it helps to make it clean this process is called filtration potable water potable water means water safe for drinking water that does not endanger our health in any way when we drink it is called safe water or potable water potable water drinking water must be safe for our health pure water has no taste smell or color if we has if water has a color or a foul smell one must avoid drinking it microorganisms microorganism means a living thing that cannot be seen by the naked eye or even with a magnifying glass microscope microscope is an instrument for looking at very very small things which we cannot see with our eye or even through a magnifying glass useful microorganisms if we take a bit of yogurt or a drop of buttermilk or a glass slide on a glass slide and place the slide under a microscope we say very tiny living things in it 
दे आर कॉल्ड माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स दीज माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स कन्वर्ट मिल्क इन टू योग हट दे आर यूजफुल फॉर अस हार्मफुल माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स ऑल माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स आर नॉट यूजफुल सम माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स कॉज डिसीजेस वेन दे एंटर आर बॉडी दे आर सेट टू बी हार्मफुल माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स Boiling water. You may know that during the rainy season, we offer here of an outbreak of diarrhea or gastritis. At such times, we need to boil the water that has been cleaned by settling and filtration. Only then does it become safe for drinking. Boiling the water kills the microorganisms in it and prevent the diseases. Thank you.